That's all I've got. Well, come on, then. Well, as soon as I've got some, I'll put it in, but meantime, I'm skint. I hope you're not messing me about. Of course I'm not. Good, because right now I could do without chasing you. I've told you, I'm skint. Right, well, as from today, we're on an economy drive. So what's new? I mean it, while your dad's away, someone has to take control of the family purse strings. Oh, and that's you, is it? Yeah. From now on, everything we earn is going in the pot. Whatever. I mean it. If I have to call Paddy out to the sow when she's farrowing, he'll want pain. That's on top of all the other bills. Well, we've always got bills, Lucy. Yeah, but right now the biggest one's got Charity's name on it. What? What do you mean? We needed the cash. So you went to the family brass, of all people? Do you think you can trust her? Don't get on your high horse with me. Your dad did exactly the same before he left. I had to make a decision. You two never, ever will. What's the use? Can't get back to work. Jarvis is work. Well, that's not a problem. Price just depends on whether or not you want it delivered by the week. Oi! What the hell are you doing? You can call him back. What do you want? A certain slate wiping clean, if that's OK with you. Oh, I see. Yeah, you see. Come not pay me back, then, have you? Cos if memory serves, the money I gave your dad and Lisa wasn't meant to be a present. Don't want me about. You've got some nerve coming in here, throwing your weight around. I have done the family a favour. Oh, well, that is really big of you, Mrs Tate. But we both know you don't do anything without benefiting in some way. Shut up, Kane. You just act off cos I can afford to help out and you can't. I only have to yell and six lorry drivers in here, all right? And when they've escorted you off the premises, I'll ring the same people that I phoned last time we had that disagreement. Do you remember them? You want to help the family out, Kane? Go and earn some money, eh? Help Lisa out just for once. In the meantime, get out of my face, all right? This is not over. Not by a long chalk. Yeah, yeah. Blow us a kiss on the way out, eh? Hiya. You OK? Yeah, I'm fine. I just... I thought you were keen. What, he's been here? Yes. What did he want? Oh, it don't matter. You know what Kane's like. Charity. Look, I've lent Lisa some more money, uh, right? And Kane wants it to be called a gift. Well, I hope you told I him. I told him to stuff it. Yes, I did, Chris. Oh, well, please forgive me. I mean, they're your family, obviously, but if you carry on giving them cash without asking for security, it may as well be called a gift. I have got security. All oh, right, well, I'm trying to think what that might be, because I don't think we're going to get much for the pigs on the open market. Of course, we'll, we'll never be without bacon. Oh, you really don't think that much of me, do you? So, what security? The house! Zack gave me the deeds with promissory note. Happy now? Oh. Good. Oh, we approve, do we? We do. Of course, as the place stands, it's comparable to a refuse tip. But the uh, development potential. Don't you even go there, Chris. I'm only doing this to help him out. Then why ask for security in the first place? Because, like I said, the money is not a gift. I just need some kind of pressure on my side, OK? OK. OK. Still, shrewd move on your side. <laughs> 